It's never too early to start learning good environmental habits like recycling. And that's the thinking behind the Junior First Lego League. It's designed for students from kindergarten to third grade, and it's the junior version of First Lego League, an international organization founded by Segway inventor Dean Kamen to teach STEM education to school kids and give them an introduction to STEM concepts using Legos. We caught up recently with a class from Chamberlain Elementary School here in Charleston with some students who wanted to show off their project. Well, this is a paint mixer. You crank this crank and, and it will make, it'll make, there's paint in there and it'll mix the paint. If you see up close, it'll zoom in or the thing. And then we can move on to the conveyor belt. There's like stuff on there. The theme for this year's contest is the Waste Watch Challenge, which deals with issues like trash, reuse, and recycling. Chamberlain's team got its inspiration from a field trip to the Habitat for Humanity Restore in Charleston. The students were particularly impressed by the paint recycling. That was really cool. Um, I thought that was pretty cool because she took old paint and made it into new paint and made different colors. And so they decided to model that. Team projects have to meet several requirements. Here's Chamberlain's coach, Mike Green. It has to be completely made out of Legos. It has to use at least one motor, and it has to have at least one simple machine. So they have to learn about simple machines and what they are, uh, and they have to learn about motors. So uh, what they decided to do was um, their simple machine uh, part of the model is the paint mixing station and it uses a little crank which uses two different gears to change the direction of the motion and turn a stirrer inside the paint vat. And uh, they decided to use their motor on a conveyor belt like you would have at a, a sorting recycling station where they put recyclables on the conveyor belt and people stand and sort them out into different piles. Okay. So uh, they got to learn about the, the science and the math and the engineering parts of design methodology which is how do you even start to design a model from scratch? This isn't a Lego kit with instructions. They have to come up with the whole concept, design it, and build it all by themselves. Coach Green says the project is a great introduction to not only engineering and design, but recycling too, all while having fun with Legos. Organizers say the program has been so popular that they had more students interested in signing up than they had spots on the team. They say they're hoping to be able to field a second team next fall.